Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to make marmalade. Marmalade is nothing but an orange jam. Can you see how nicely it came out? And I make this every year since I have orange tree in my garden. This year I thought I would share it with you. This is my garden crayon orange tree and it has lots of oranges in there. I'm going to pick 10 of them. Now we start doing the preparation. First I'm going to start peeling the chest of 6 oranges. We don't want to get the white stuff because it will give bitterness to the jam. We need to try to avoid as much as we can. Once we got the uh, skin, we can just uh, scrap out all the white stuff from there. We only need the oranges, we don't need the white stuff. This is how I get the oranges for the marmalade. If you have some other way to just to get the chest, you can do it. But this is the easy way. Now I got rid of him. I'm going to slice it into very thin pieces. This orange chest will give nice flavor to the marmalade. Now I'm going to squeeze out the juice from 7 oranges out of 10. I'm going to squeeze out all the oranges using my orange squeezer. Now I got the juice from 7 oranges. The other 3 oranges that I have, I'm going to cut them into big chunk slices. Just like this. Once we pre prepared everything, we need to weigh them so that we can add enough amount of sugar in it. I'm going to add everything together and weigh it. It's weighed 600 gram. So I'm going to add 300 grams of sugar, which is half of that amount. Now boil it. It's nearly take one hour to make this marmalade. After half an hour, can you see it's uh, reduced a little bit and also the chunk starting to dissolve as well. We need to stir it now and then so that it won't uh, burn at the bottom of the pan. Now it's starting to thicken a little bit. I'm going to put it on a plate and see whether it's ready. And if you put it on the plates, it's it's runny. That means it's not ready yet. I'm going to keep it for another 15 minutes. I'm going to put it on the plate again to see whether it's ready. We keep it for 5 to 10 minutes to cool down. If you run the finger through like this, it needs to be like this. It is almost ready. So I'm just going to leave it for another 5 minutes and turn off the flame. Now the marmalade is ready, I'm going to keep it to cool down. Now I'm going to put it in an airtight container and keep it for later use. Thank you.